I'm going to go over the cell cycle and um, focus on the first part of the cell cycle today. The first part of the cell cycle is interphase, which basically is the preparation for division. Interphase, as you see right here, is the longest part of the cycle. I'm going to add that for you right here. The cell goes through the cycle constantly, but the longest part is interphase. I'm going to focus on that today. Um, interphase has three parts, G1, S, which is the synthesis phase, the synthesizing of DNA, and G2. The second part of the cycle is mitosis phase, which is division uh, of the cell. They, it can also be called mitotic phase or the M phase, and I'll cover that in my next video. And the last part of the cell cycle is cytokinesis, which is when the cytoplasm splits. So let's focus on interphase. As I mentioned, G1 is the first part. Basically what's happening here is the cell is going to double in size. Organelles are reproduced inside the cell. So you're going to have reproduction of mitochondria, reproduction of ER, whatever it is. So the cell has to grow in order to accommodate all those organelles. Then you have the synthesis phase which is the making of and what's being made here is DNA as you see here's one chromosome and then there's the pair and they split and they they also double in order to accommodate for the second cell being produced G2 is secondary growth this is where the cell is actually preparing to divide you have to know each part of the cell um, during division so these structures right here are called centrioles Centromeres are these uh, spiral things that surround, I'm sorry, centrosomes. You have to know what the cell looks like during interphase. So you have to be able to recognize these structures. If you see centrioles together, you actually see a nucleus. And you could see the membrane and all the chromatin inside uh, the nuclear envelope. That's interphase. 